Today, we got a fun unpacking from our friends at Electric Milk Creations. If you ever want to send me something you want me to unpack, you can send it right to this address right here. If you want to get some awesome stuff, get kids started in comics or get some stuff for yourself or whoever, check out Electric Milk Creations. Check out artbaltazar.com. I have the links in the show notes. Uh, take a swig quick, see how make sure my coffee's not going ice cold, as Art would say. <laughs> take a swig if you got it. And as the critic would say, don't take a swig. <laughs> Taking a swig or eating food ruins the podcast. <laughs> Pack your stuff, Balthazar. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. Well, I was really happy because art site was down for a while, for a long while. You could still get stuff, but just didn't have his new items on there. So I wanted to get caught up on everything that I was missing from the past few months, or double or triple up like tend to do with things. But that is fine because we uh. Got some kids that have been coming into my wife's pharmacy, and she wants some comics that she can hand out there. All ages friendly. So, I'm starting to put some together for her. So, she can do that with comics. Let's see what we got here. Got her. A receipt. <laughs> we have Lunar Lizard number one. And if you order through com, he'll sign his comics for you. You don't even have to ask. They usually come signed. But Lunar Lizard number one. I thought I read this. But I don't have this cover. It might have been a Lunar Lizard number zero that I read. Instead of number one. Superpowers. This is trying to finish getting the ones that I'm missing. This is number five. The all the awesomeness of his artwork. Art Balthazar's artwork. Fun. Nice, colorful. Easy reads. They have wonderful stories, wonderful crossovers. Characters are just so much fun, and then he also does deal with DC characters and many other characters also. But he tends to put the "oh yeah" feel into <laughs> all his stuff that he does. But Art and Franco are an awesome combination combination of creators that we like to follow. But this is Superpowers number three. Yeah, it's Superpowers number four. Superpowers number six. And we got Tiny Titans. These are the ones that I'm pretty sure I have. But I just picked them up just in case because I didn't really recognize all these covers. And so that's a problem with me. That's when I end up doubling on and tripling up on stuff. Because I see a cover I like and I buy it all the time instead of just thinking about whether or not I have it or not. Uh, this is number 13. 14. Glad. On the cover there. Lagoon Boy. Yeah, number 12. And we got another pack of goodies here. These are the more, oh uh, yeah, related. Uh, gotta put all the goodies off to the side. Oh, yeah. Lunar Lizard number. Oh, okay. <laughs> I seen the $5 uh, thing, and I thought it said number five, but number two. 
I apparently do not have one and two because I do not recognize it. So. And Webster's Spider Monkey, number zero. Pretty sure I got a couple copies of this guy. <laughs> Webster's Spider Monkey, number one. Which I don't know if I picked up number one yet or not. Storyline, no, I don't recognize the storyline, so I may not have... Oh, Webster Spider Monkey number one yet, which is awesome because I really love the Webster character. I, I love all the yeah characters. Can't go wrong with them. And then Action Cat and Adventure Bug is number three point five. Uh, I feel I feel like I've seen this story, but I may have seen number three or number four. And this is a little extra that I might have missed out on. A little cray bird. Love the little mini posters. Those are awesome. <laughs> Art Ball Desires. Tired of some of those characters. And then there's the contact info if you want to check it out. But like I said, I will put it in the show notes also. There. Drink. Uh, <laughs> drink cozy. Drink. Uh, <laughs> cup holders. Drink stand. <laughs> Uh, oh, Art must be breaking off his series sets. He sent a single one. He's got these sets of cards of that are from his paintings that he's done in the past. I think there's five sets. And he's got them numbered and signed, and each set with comes with looks like six six different paintings in it. And if you see the Silver Surfer one there, Anthony from our Crimson Color Comic Club, Cartoons by Night and stuff. I know he's got that one, but I haven't got a, bought a painting yet from him. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then on one of his last podcasts, he mentioned that. He had orders going out and stuff, but he mentioned me. <laughs> oh, he's nagging about the cards because I started, me and Anthony were collecting the cards and began swapping them with each other. When we first started buying stuff from our Belt Desire, uh, at least when I first started buying, Anthony was probably buying for a while before I did. But <laughs> I gave him shit on my last few videos because there were no cards in there. And I'm like, <laughs> I look forward to those. Because I collect those things. <laughs> yeah, a nice little... I should have actually pulled them out before I did this today. I only got two books within my reach. You know? No. These are the ones that have cards in them. Oh, it doesn't look like that one. These are Little photo albums that hold nice card size pictures in it because it's hard to find nice books to keep your stuff in there. But we like doing them in those style books. That way we can just set them on a coffee table. Or something like this. A picture of couple of characters that <laughs> could be me and the wife. <laughs> and we got Webster the Spider Monkey. Lunar Lizard. Ah. And a bat character. That's awesome. Wife will love that. So, <laughs> got herself some more sketch cards again. So, that's awesome. 
add those to the collection. Yeah, check out artbaltazar.com, Electric Milk, Milk Creations. Oh, yeah, comics. They have all kinds of wonderful things coming out. He is just going off the rails, just having a blast, putting out tons of stuff this year. Uh, he was shooting for a comic uh, a month that he wanted to put out in his on his website, but he's kind of, he's ending up with lots of other stuff that he's getting his hands into. Also, uh, we have a really fun thing coming up around Free Comic Book Day. They're going to have a unpacking party or something like that, a, or an unveiling party, I guess you would call it at IAC Comics in Skokie, Illinois, and free comic book day weekend. So uh, check that out. That is for Art Baltazar's Cat in the Hat book, which is cool that he's getting in his hand into Dr. Seuss. And there's some other things that I've heard about, but I'm not going to mention them or tease them because I don't know what's been uh, announced around the area, around for anything yet. Fully, I don't want to be giving away any surprises, but that's in the pre-order catalogs and stuff, so you can get that pre-ordered at your local comic shop or order it through artbaltazar.com or oh yeah, comics or wherever they're selling it. And it just it looks awesome. I expect everything to be enjoyable through them i have yet to find anything i haven't enjoyed you can check out art baltasar's uh youtube where he does cartoonist says things cartoonist draws things cartoonist paints things uh, you can see him working on some of his upcoming projects and just watch him work with the art and layouts and all that coloring and stuff putting them together it's a lot of fun listening to him and the the critic arguing back and forth. <laughs> but yeah, this is from Oh Yeah Comics. Lots of Oh Yeah Awesomeness. And the fun thing about all the Oh Yeah Comics comics, the backs always have character portraits and stuff like that. With the background of Art's painting studio floor. Uh, all kinds of fun characters. It's like, I just want to get <laughs> duplicates of everything just so I can make a wall panel of just the back, the characters with the painted floor, floor background. I think that would be cool to just make one big wall mural of all those different characters. But yeah, that was a fun one. So check it out. We will get back to you with more unpacking videos sometime soon. Oh uh, yeah, comics, awesome characters, fun stuff, DC stuff, all kinds of things that you can get your hands on. The wrestling comics, they're that with uh, Kazarian and Chris. I got the wrong people's names in my head right now. So now you're going to say it. But uh, he did a couple wrestling comics that were awesome from a couple wrestlers. And Christopher Daniels and, and Kazarian, I think it is. And my MS brain's all over the place today. Uh, but uh, yeah, he's working on some more of those, more issues of that. So I was super happy about that. Is I definitely wanted to see a variety of those comics out there, and I'm trying to put together a bunch of wrestling style things for a special podcast summon up, coming up this summer. So hopefully, I can get my hands on some of that stuff also. So we will see. But check it out. Check him out. He's awesome. Keep following under the color of MS. Rate, review, subscribe, tell a friend, help us get those subscriptions up there and those likes up there. See if we can't get some notice. <laughs> and we will keep putting the stuff out as long as you keep watching it. Okay. Bye.